What's up guys, Linux Noob here with another video. Now today's video is just a quick one and it's about a problem that I was having recently uh, while trying to use Kdenlive on Manjaro Linux with XFCE desktop. Now uh, I'll quickly show you what exactly the problem is. Now when you o install and open up Kdenlive, I'll just confirm for a second for you that this is indeed the latest version of Kdenlive on Manjaro Linux 15.12. Now the problem actually is when you open up Kdenlive you can see very clearly that there are a uh, lot of icons that are actually missing. The options over here and as well as some options over here are missing. Now I've tried changing themes and that actually didn't work so it's not really a problem with the theming uh, on, on XFCE. Now, uh, this problem uh, is not specific to XFCE actually, I found this problem to be happening with Mate and LXDE at the same time on Manjaro Linux as well as while trying to use vanilla Arch Linux with these desktop environments. So I think it's a fairly good guess that this problem is happening with uh, the vanilla Arch Linux and uh, Arch Linux derivatives while trying to use GTK based uh, desktop environments on them. So uh, the solution to this is actually what I found to be uh, pretty easy. All you have to do is go and open up package manager, the PAMAC package manager on Arch Linux or Manjaro, whatever you're using and go and search for KD runtime. Now from here, uh, you'll see that there's a package called KDE Base Runtime. All you have to do is go ahead and install it. And that should theoretically fix the problem. Now I'll just quickly go ahead and install it. Put in the password. And then uh, wait for it to finish installing. Now I've already uh, done this before, so in my case it didn't need to uh, re-download the packages, it's just installing them, but in your case it will automatically download the packages and install them so it won't really be a problem. Now now when you open up Kdenlive, you'll see that uh, indeed the icons are there, everything should work fine, and uh, the fix is actually that easy. Now if the problem is still there for you then uh, you can try installing another two packages all you have to do oops sorry uh, all you have to do is open up package manager search for another package called KD workspace now there you'll find that there is this one package named plasma workspace go ahead and install it as well as search for another package called FREI0R and you'll see there's this package called FREI0R-plugins install that as well and that should generally in almost all the cases solve your problem now I won't be installing these two packages right now here because as you can see the problem is fixed for me but if you're still having problems after using installing the KDE runtime package do try installing these two packages as well so uh, there you go guys that's the fix now I used Manjaro Linux XFCE version to demonstrate uh, the fix here for you but uh, this should uh, definitely work for any Arch Linux or Arch Linux derivatives uh, while using it with any of the GTK based desktop environments that I mentioned, namely XFC, LXD, Mate or any other GTK base, uh, based desktop environment. So if you're having the same problem, do try this out and let me know in the comment section down below if the solution works for you as well as well as which uh, distribution you are trying to install it and with which desktop environment. So as always, like the video if you liked it, uh, 
leave your feedback in the comment section down below and do subscribe to the channel for more upcoming Linux videos. And I'll see you in the next video.